What's up guys, Ruxin34 back with another epic opening and today we have some stuff from Walmart. I went to my closest Walmart and usually they have absolutely nothing and they did have a chaos box and six legacy blisters. So I was like, I have to pick these up. That'll be an exciting video. So that's what we're doing for today's video. And we have some absolutely insane videos coming up. Tomorrow will be Rage of Raw. We're going to open up probably three booster boxes or something like that. My case has been delayed, unfortunately, so it's not shipping until you see this video. So the day you see this video is when it's shipping. So it's either going to get here Saturday or Monday. So we'll see about if we do a live stream or if we just do videos or what we do with that. Um, but yeah, so let me know what you guys want to see. Do you want to see a live for Rage of Raw to pull the ghost? Um, we do have other openings before that, so maybe we'll have already pulled it. We'll see. Also, we have some other insane openings. The 20,000 subscriber special is coming up very soon. We're less than 800 subscribers away. And there's some other epic legacy pack openings coming up. And I'm talking about a lot. It's going to be awesome. So make sure you guys hit the subscribe button for that. And don't forget to use my TCG Player and eBay affiliate links below if you want to support the channel. All you have to do is click those links below and buy anything you were going to buy from eBay or TCG Player, not just from me. And it supports my channel. You guys have been killing those links, which has been awesome and helpful. So let's get into the opening. The giveaway for this video, Giant True Nade from Magic Ruler, Enemy Controller from Ancient Sanctuary, and Kinetic Soldier. Make sure you guys like the video and subscribe to enter that giveaway. Also, let me know in the comments, what is your favorite of these legacy packs that we're opening? Because you're probably gonna see a lot more of each one, so it's gonna be pretty cool. Let me know in the comments. Also, speaking of giveaways, all you have to do is check the community tab popping up on the screen to see if you guys won one of the last like 40 giveaways. I just posted them the other day, and let's get into the video. All right, let's start with this Chaos Box. By the way, guys, my voice is fine. <laughs> this is, you guys ask me this every time, but sometimes I'm a little raspy. That's just how my voice is. I don't know. It just, it just happens. I drink lots of water, so it's not because I don't drink water. I drink water constantly, but I just kind of have this kind of, uh, you know, sometimes my voice gets dry. Just how it works. Well, let's see what we get in here. So first of all, you get four booster packs, four duels packs, and one mystery blister. So let's see if we can get some Kaiba packs. We're probably going to get Yugi, let's be honest, unfortunately. Because there are no ulties in there. It'd be cool if there was an ulti Dark Paladin or something. That'd be insane, actually. Okay, first pack. Dark Saviors, unlimited. That's cool. Okay, let's see what the, the blister is. Okay, it, it, okay, it's one of the literal mystery blisters. Okay, I thought they just meant any blister. Ooh, Duelist Alliance. We did open a good amount of that. We opened 100 packs in one video, so make sure you guys check out that video. That was fun. Maybe we'll pull the Ghost. And we have Cybernetic Horizon. This is one we didn't have in first edition on the 10K video. So I ended up having to buy a monster box to get it in Unlimited. Here is Duelist Pack Kaiba. Okay, we have a chance at Ultimate Rares. Okay, hopefully all four of them will be that. That would be nice. Then we have a Shining Victories. These things are everywhere. <laughs> it's kind of funny. We have Yugi. Oh, there we go. Kind of a worthless pack, unfortunately. We have Duelist Alliance again. Interesting. Two Duelist Alliance. Then we have... Uh, what is that? Speed Duel. Oh, no. Okay, that's it. Four Duelist Packs. There's only two. What? Did they count Speed Duel as one? What was the other one? Okay, there was definitely only two Duelist Packs. That's weird. Maybe there's an ulti. Maybe it's Destin. Should we save this one for last? Let's save that for last. That could be crazy. Well, last before we get into the blisters. Okay, let's just start opening. Let's start with the Yugi because you really just... You can pull Mirror Force, which is super cheap because it's been reprinted so much. Dark Paladin's really the only good pull out of here. So, let's see if... We, our Dark Magician Girl's all right. Queen's Knight. Brain Control. And Marshmallow. All right, not a good start. We're going to save this Duel's Pack High because that could have an ultimate rare. So, okay, let's try and get a Sphere Karibo. I pulled a bunch of these in my day. Yeah, um, I don't do a lot of speed duel on here, but, um, because a lot of you guys don't really like it. Also, not gonna lie, it's just, uh, I mean, it's okay, it's just not that interesting. The low, not having high rarities is not very interesting to me. Okay, let's go to Duelist Alliance. Here we go. Can we pull Shadal Construct Ulti? That would be epic. Pop up. Dagu, Curse of the Shadow Prison, Hip Hippo, and Hymn of Light. Okay. Shining Victories. What was um? What's this guy called? He's called Crystal Wing. Yeah, not Clear Wing. That's that is Cross Souls. There we go. This one's Crystal Wing Synchro Dragon. Black Wing. 
Gear get anchor, okay. Oh, unwavering bond, ultra rare. That's our first hit, unwavering bond. Spirit of the Fall Wind, digital bug, and kaiju files. Okay, where is our sleeve? There we go. Ka uh, not kaiju files. Unwavering bond, ultra rare. There we go. Not bad. Let's go to Dark Saviors. Let's see what we can do out of this one. This one's guaranteed secret rare, I think. I don't really remember what's in here. Drowning Mirror Forest. Okay, that's cool. Pandora. Vampire Orcus. Awakening. Oh, okay. I think this card's pretty good. The Shark Cannon's actually worth a few bucks. I, I can't remember if it went up or down after the last ban list, but it was like three bucks in first edition, so that's unlimited, but that's cool. Cybernetic Horizon, Saiho, you can get the Boral Sword Dragon out of here. Uh, I think there's another good card in here, out of it, but I can't really remember. Shield Handler, Psychic Ace. Oh, oh, we got something. Oh! We got it! Boral Sword Dragon, that is a big pull. That's one, I think that is the best card in the set. Boral Sword Dragon, unlimited, but a secret rare nonetheless. That is pretty awesome. Boral Sword Dragon. I never pulled that card before. I don't know the exact value of it, but I know it's pretty valuable. It did get reprinted, um, but still incredible. Wow. I was like, wait a second. Did we just pull it? And we did. So this is good. We've pulled uh, three decent cards already. Duelist Alliance. Now we need the ulti shit all construct. That would be a huge pull. That card's like over $50. Okay. Spicy Spy. Spicy Spy. I see what they did there. Turn Toad. Okay. Vega. No foil in that pack. Okay, so now we're down to the ulti in the mystery pack. Let's go for a chance at ulti. Duelist Pack Kaiba. You guys have already heard this story. The pack that brought me back. Duelist Pack Kaiba. Here we go. Ring of Defense. Business Reflect. Ancient Lamp and Vampire Lord. Okay. Those are really hard to pull ultis out of. I think I've pulled two. I pulled Crush Card and Chaos and Bird Dragon. All right. Mystery Pack. Mystery Box. Mystery... Mystery pack. Yeah, but um, I would love to pull a pot of greed out of there one day. Okay, we've got... Oh, is that what I think it is? Okay, we got Binary Sorceress. That's a Legend of Blue Eyes pack. Okay. We got a Legend of Blue Eyes pack, so let's see what we can do. L-O-B. Here we go. Can we pull a Blue Eyes White Dragon? These things just never seem to come out of these packs. I have pulled one once, but it's really tough. Okay, let's go Terror the Terrible. Tie home. Skull Servant. And a Goblin Secret Remedy. Okay, Witty Phantom. Nothing in that pack, but that's okay. We'll be seeing more LOB in the future, guys. We are going to pull that Blue Eyes. That's a guarantee. We've also never pulled Exodia Head, so that would be pretty cool. All right, now we have these Mystery Blisters. Guys, okay, I've told you guys this. I told a lot of you guys this before. Some of you guys have not heard it. In this one of these packs, I pulled... Out of these back cards right here, they're just the random cards. A Ghost Rare Galaxy Eyes Photon Dragon. What? I have done that. It was before YouTube, so there's no evidence. So the guy that commented the other day about he loved my 10K video, but he didn't believe any of it, you know, after <laughs> he didn't believe any of it after the camera cut off. You're not gonna believe this, and so some other people won't, but it did happen. I didn't have YouTube. The, and at the time it was only a ten dollar card. It was a ghost rare, but it was only ten bucks. But I was like, oh my goodness, this is so cool. It's the first Ghost Rare I ever owned. Okay, look at this. We have a Dusa card, Guard Penguin. And then we have a Crimped card. So that's pretty weird. But yeah, that was like the only good card I've ever pulled. Magical Merchant, that's nice. Ever pulled out of the back of these. And it was a crazy one too. Like, I mean, it was. I was like, a Ghost Rare? Are you kidding me? I mean, the chances are minuscule, but it was super cool. I wish I was doing YouTube at that time. But that was well before YouTube. Actually, I may have been doing Duel Links, but I wasn't doing openings. Okay. Dark Crisis. Well, I definitely was doing Duel Links because I started Duel Links before I started, you know, coming back to, to uh, the cards. Oh, Geometria. Let's see if we can pull something good. What do we want? We want um, Exodia Necros. We want Skull Archfiend of Lightning. We want Vampire Lord. We want something like that. All right. Checkmate. Really Eternal Rest. Maju Garzette, that's a good one. Death Feral Imp. Okay, there's a Guardian. A Guardian Axe Grow. Gaga Gigo. Alright. Next pack. Nothing out of Dark Crisis, but we do have Pharaoh's Servant. You guys know what we want out of here. We want Buster Blader. We want Thousand Nights Restrict. And we want Genzo. Those are the big cards. Those are the ones we want. Also, 
Legendary Fisherman would be pretty cool as well. Horn of the Phantom Beast. Vampire Crimson. Okay. Arm Oh, that's an old card. DP2. Tactical Evolution. Venom Burn. Ancient Prophecy. We get a Magic Jammer. Okay, sometimes you will get these older cards. That's some older commons. That's pretty cool. All right. Pharaoh Servant. Make sure you guys hit the like button for luck. Also, I'm super excited for Rage of Raw, guys. So make sure you check out tomorrow's video. It's going to be good. I'll probably might premiere it so just so we can hang out together. All right, Sword Hunter. The uh, premieres have been pretty fun. All Seeing White Tiger. Metal Detector. Gradius. And a Magic Drain. Okay, Dokuro Yaiba. No luck so far out of our Legacy Packs. Spell Ruler it is. Number one spell ruler card. We pulled it the other day. Blue Eyes Toon Dragon. Make sure you check that video out. But it was out of 21 packs and we only got three foils. So not the best ratios. Maybe this time we get epic ratios. Only two packs and we get something crazy. Okay, Neo Spatian Flare. Spatian. Spatian Flare Scarab. Contact Out is actually a valuable common. That's pretty good. Rhinoceros. Yeah, that's, that's pretty funny. That's actually worth something. I'm trying to think of... Total cost of this opening was like... 70 bucks it was eight bucks for all these times six so 48 last time i did math in my head i totally screwed it up which is funny so it was 48 bucks plus 20 so 68 plus tax so that's how much this this opening costs if you guys are one of the people that want to see how much i neg or plus 68 was the cost i'll put up the pulls at the end turtle oath minar psychic kappa sinju okay with a report and giant turtle feeds on flames Okay, so we're 0 for 4 on Legacy Packs. We did hit a Boral Sword, though, so that was really cool. I think Contact Out's like a $1 common or more. So that's pretty cool, actually. All right, let's see what we got here. Yeah, I'm just waiting for the day to pull another Ghost Rare. It's never going to happen again, but I hope it does. <laughs> Hanzo. X-Head Cannon, that's cool. Gear Town's actually decent, I think. Phantom Hand. German, German Infection? What is that from? MRD, and that's original, too. Magic card. Wow, that's old school. Okay, that's pretty cool. Now we just need a foil. Spell ruler. Let's do this. Here we go, guys. Hit the like button for luck. And, of course, comment for your for your chance at the giveaway. There we go. Wow, on the wall. House of Adhesive Tape. Queen Bird. Karate Man. Oh, man, we are striking out so far. Toll. There's the toll. It's like, here, give me your money. Give me your money. You're not going to pull anything. Okay, Metal Raiders, you can save us here. I have pulled... I think I've pulled everything. I've pulled two Gate Guardians out of this before, but that was also before I was on YouTube. So it doesn't really count. I did pull a Summon Skull on YouTube, though. So that was cool. Gishki Noelia. Grisail of Prison. Also, let me know if any of these are good commons that I don't pull out. Risky Warrior. Queen's Pawn. Two more packs, two more chances at something epic so far. We've had, well, we did hit the Boral Sword, but in the Legacy Packs, we haven't hit anything. Okay. Labyrinth Tank. Here we go. Dream Clown. Give us something good, Metal Raiders. Mystic Horseman. Crass Clown. Elegant Egotist. Queen's Double. Kaminari Attack is decent. I think it's like 50 cents. Whew, it comes down to the last pack, guys. Are we going to strike out? on the legacy packs fortunately we do have world sword it did get some of our value back so we're not the other packs were actually really good the non legacy oh look at this okay we hit something cool out of here it's not that valuable we've got a silent swordsman level five from elemental energy special edition oh man it was actually pretty good condition besides that that might still be worth like a buck i bet that's worth like a buck I mean, it's probably less on tcg player but i mean it's solid dollar Silent Swordsman, that's really cool. Then we have Dark Flare Dragon. That's super cool as well. Spider Spider. I mean, there's some, sometimes there's cool stuff in there. Usually there's garbage, but sometimes there's cool stuff. Okay, Metal Raiders. It just shows you that the people repacking these have no idea about Yu-Gi-Oh, you know? They, like, they wouldn't put a Ghost Rare in there. If they were scaling these packs, like, it, like a bunch of people say, they wouldn't have put a Ghost Rare in the packaging for free. Like, they wouldn't have done that. So it just kind of shows you they don't really care. They're just reselling the packs. Okay, Metal Raiders. Final pack, guys. Can we get some luck? We got a Harpy Lady on the front. Guilty of the D-Knight. Musician King. Whew, let's do this. 
crass clown and white ma white magical hat. If you guys have seen the progression series, that guy had a lot had a big role. He had a big role. Okay. So let's see what we got, guys, from the legacy packs. Bum 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 bum. That's it. That's nothing else. We didn't pull anything. Well, I guess you could say we pulled these. So we did pull the contact out and the sound swords, so we got like two bucks out of that. So 48 spent about two dollars back and a bunch of commons. So that aren't really worth anything. Then from the when it comes to the what was it called? What was that box called? Whatever the box was called. I spent 20 bucks and we got this. Unwavering Bond, Shark Cannon, and Boral Sword. So we I think we made our money back on that one. So for that box we made our money back. The blisters we lost big time. So that's just how it goes sometimes. But overall, pretty fun opening. We didn't do well on these legacy packs, but there are a lot of legacy packs to come, and there will be good pulls. There's gonna be a lot of good openings. Hope you guys do like the old school, because whenever I post stuff like that, we're opening a lot of old school, you guys like it. So that's why I decided to get more. And I'm really excited about it too. So make sure you subscribe. The 20,000 is coming up. I'm probably gonna record it this weekend, I'm thinking. Because we're gonna be, I'm thinking we can get there by maybe next week. Next week at some point. So I'm super excited for that. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. And that's it for today, guys. I'll see you guys later. Peace. Elemental Hero, Dark Bright, Boom! Oh.